Welcome everybody. Let me know if this time you can hear me. This is the third time that I try to do this live stream. And yeah, um, honestly, um, it's getting a bit frustrating for me. Uh, I'm not the type of person that quits. So yeah, this is the third time that I try. I think that now the issue is solved. Please let me know in the comments if you can hear me, okay? And I'm going to write it down as well. Okay. okay. Okay, guys, I think I think that you can hear me and I think that you can also see me. Okay. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. But let me know, let me know in the comments um if you can hear me. And yeah, let me know in the comments if you can hear me. Let me know if you can see me. Um, just let me know, okay? Because I don't want to start. I won't start this again, okay? This is the, the third time that I try. And it will be the last time that I try, okay? I think... I think that this is working. I think that this is working. I think that now you can hear me. Let me know in the chat, okay? Happy Halloween, first of all. Happy Halloween to everyone. Day of the Dead. If you celebrate, uh, whatever you are doing, I hope you are doing well. I hope you are fine, okay? If you're safe. And I'm gonna write down here, Happy Halloween to everyone. Happy Halloween to everyone. Let me know if you see anything, okay? Anything strange, demons, uh, ghosts, okay? Let me know if you see anything unusual, okay, tonight. I will probably go out later uh, or tomorrow. Maybe I will go out later. Yeah. Yeah. I will probably go for, for a ride uh, with my car and see what's going to happen. Uh, I'm not going to any party anyway. Please let me know in the chat if you can hear me. Okay. Can you hear me? What was that? I heard a very strange noise. <laughs> da -da -da, da -da -da. Yeah. You can comment um, below and you can also use the chat. I really recommend to use the chat, okay guys? To let me know if you can see me, if you can hear me. Um, because it's actually really, um, it's a really fast chat, okay? This mode is really fast. Um, I made sure in the settings to have a very fast, um, mode, so I could reply to you and I could, you know, um, see your messages, see, 
see all the the messages in the chat in real time so i made sure of it i just need to know if you are able to hear me because it's kind of important and i don't want to talk uh, for 30 minutes and no one is listening to me okay no one is hearing me so i need you to let me know in the chat let me know please in the chat let me know in the chat there is a chat on your side on your right hand side if you are with your mobile it should be below if you are on your laptop it should be on the right hand side can you hear me can you hear me yes or no please let me know in the comments yes or no can you hear me yes or no yes or no can you let me know if you can hear me can you hear me can you hear me let's see if i maybe log out maybe it's a problem that i have with the phone or maybe i don't see your your messages i don't know okay that is okay yes oh thank you so much for for the confirmation perfect okay thank you jh music and movies and film sorry and wow you must love horror movies do you love horror movies i think i will have like a movie night for sure we'll probably watch yeah of course dracula by drum stalker uh, of course i will watch a lot of dracula versions <laughs> different versions of the movie and yeah i think i will have a movie night and i will probably first go out and go for a ride and see if i see anything you know unusual and then i'll come back and i will do my movie night with some wine something like that so let me know how you're celebrating this halloween what are you doing if you have a costume i i really don't celebrate like i don't go out i don't do parties and it's more like a very intimate thing for me like it's very spiritual you know yes there is the movie you know the the fun part but there is also like the spiritual celebration for me so it's a very um, yeah it's a very spiritual celebration it's a spiritual celebration it's the day when we remember uh, the dead our ancestors the day when we connect with the afterlife you know with this uh this other world so it's like these two words are coming together the word of you know the living where we are living and yeah the the word of the the dead basically and it's fascinating and and i also like you know to dress up but yeah today it's just me you know as i usually dress up it's very gothic um there is some color usually i wear black but today i wanted to have you know yeah color color is nice red is nice and so yeah let me know if you like the way i dressed up and let me know if you like my makeup i've done my makeup i've done my you know style and but i'm not going to any party this is just for me and for you guys you know for this channel when i do the videos but i'm not dressing up to to go to any party i'm not uh, not a party go girl um i actually i don't know if you you have been you know on this channel if you are you know subscribed to this channel but i haven't been posting uh, in this last the last two weeks i haven't been uh doing any videos this is because uh, i was really busy uh, with my life like my real life but also i didn't want to um i didn't want to do 
too many things. Uh, I need a space for myself. So that's why I didn't post any videos. And I'm also not on the social media. I'm not on Facebook. I'm not on Instagram. Um, I have disabled my social media accounts, Facebook and Instagram, because I felt like there was just too much dark energy, too much toxicity, too much, too much in general. And I really needed a break. And I honestly don't know if I'm going to go back to, to the social media, just to let you know. Let me know if you agree with me that the social media is toxic and useless. It can be useful sometimes for work and for, yeah, for work, but not for other things, in my opinion. And coming back yeah, to Halloween, yeah, I do celebrate by myself, but I'm not really for, you know, traditional celebrations. Like, I do celebrate in my own way. And so I encourage you to celebrate in your own way. Do what you feel uh, you want to do. Don't do things because, you know, your friends are doing that or your family is doing that or, you know, the friend of a friend is doing that. And just do what you feel you want to do. If you are by yourself, celebrate by yourself. Like I don't have any friends in Leeds. I have friends that are basically all over the world. So I really don't meet them. And, and again, I don't go to parties. So I usually celebrate by myself. And I will probably go to the cemetery uh, and I will, yeah, take a walk. Uh, there and i also want to take a walk to the woods do you like going you know to the woods and in nature i really love doing that yeah let me know if you like doing that it would be very nice yeah to go to the cemetery and it's very quiet i like it where there are no people <laughs> yeah um so much in the hermit mood right now but um, slowly coming out of it but again I don't think that I will be back on the social media I think I will probably stay away from that as much as I can as much as I can yes and yeah let me know what you think let me know if you agree with me in the in the chat in the comments can hear you that's great yeah, if you, if you can hear me, that's great. That's fantastic. That's really an improvement. And Colonel, hello there. How are you doing? That's another weird noise. So yeah, that's pretty much it. What I'm going to do to celebrate basically and yeah this is this is a day to celebrate the dead to celebrate our ancestors the people that we miss that we have lost you know and so yeah i'm not in mood for for parties honestly and because i know that this is a spiritual celebration and actually halloween I found out that it's connected to uh, Christian uh, Christian beliefs and practices and also it's a pagan celebration and yes connected to of course uh, pagan celebration and it's not just about you know dressing up and costumes uh, it's really about uh, connecting with another world, the afterlife, remembering the dead, uh, remembering our ancestors, uh, what and who we were in other past lives, you know, as at least as what I, you know, I see it in this way. And so, yeah, it's it's a time where I really want to be by myself and really go, you know, really deep. Um, in word.
and avoid the crowds, avoid, you know, parties, really avoid, you know, all of the chaos and and avoid, you know, spending my money in things that are not really um, necessary. And I didn't buy a costume. I, I didn't buy anything, you know, decorations or other things. Uh, why, why would I waste my money in that, you know, that type of stuff that anyways, you know, it's, I don't know. Why would I do that? You can always, you know, create something buying like a pumpkin and that you can make your own pumpkin um, that sort of thing you know having a candle inside the pumpkin uh, something handmade but yeah when it comes to celebration I think that we need to be aware that society really pushes us you know to spend money and to become more capitalistic and really uh, it's a very very can be a very dark energy it can be very dark because we then we lose um, the focus and we forget about what we are really celebrating you know what the celebration is about and it's really spiritual it's it's not about parties it's not about uh, you know uh, buying things and decorating and of course, yes, it's 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 normal. You want to have fun and you know and doing these things, but you can always do it. it that's not what this day is about. Okay, this is a really spiritual celebration. So that's how I see it, anyways. I am an Aquarius, so I can be very serious sometimes. You know, my ruling planet is Saturn, so yeah. I'm serious, like really serious, very serious. And yeah, um, what else? I want to talk to you before, you know, you go away, before we get interrupted, you know, because now that I have the audio, I feel extremely, extremely powerful and confident, you know, because now that I can talk to you, um, I really want to share this with you. So regarding my career, I'm still making music, even though... Um, I'm not uh, pushing myself as much as I was before and I'm really taking the time for doing things, uh, doing things in my own time and I found out that the balance is more important for me than, you know, producing three albums or, you know, singles or whatever. So my... What I'm trying to say is that it is important for me to make music, of course, but there are other things that are as important as making music, like my finances and the sense of stability. So I want to feel stable. I want to feel, I want to be free and I want to be independent. And as many creators out there, Unfortunately, art doesn't always provide um, a reliable source of income, okay? And yes, I have been selling a lot of merchandise. Yes, I've been uh, doing lots of live shows. But it really doesn't provide uh, a constant source of income. And that's what uh, I really... Uh, was worried, you know, about really in the last years, in the last two years. And I really found out that I really needed to feel more stable. And so I found other two jobs. So I'm currently doing music, videos and all of these things. But I also have uh, two part-time jobs. And one is very flexible, is with Amazon Flex. So... I am an Amazon Flex driver. This is what um, I have, you know, been doing in the last month. And it's basically deliver delivering packages, delivering uh, mostly envelopes and in and around leads and even very far from leads, depending, you know, when they want, where they want to send you, basically. And 
and it's very flexible so that has been working okay sometimes it is really easy some shifts are really easy other shifts are really difficult and the other job that i'm doing is with children i absolutely love children so they are very inspiring and it's it's actually a job that i really love and i wouldn't do anything if i wasn't you know enjoying it so i wouldn't do yeah i wouldn't apply for an office job if i know that that job is going to kill my creativity but with the yeah the job working with children is really creative and i just feel very connected to to children and i feel that yeah it really helps me it helps uh, my mental health has improved and i feel like i am really um helping them you know growing and mentoring them is really rewarding for me it's really rewarding so i'm very happy that now having these other two source of income i can finally feel very stable financially and my finances have improved a lot my credit score has improved has improved a lot um my mm, not requested advice to all the creators out there is that yes um art is important of course creative you know creative things are important it's your talent you were born with a talent that's probably what you're supposed to do right you have to do something with that talent uh it's a gift but at the same time uh, don't forget that other things are equally important you know that you need to think about your finances your future and yeah without that you know without the financial stability it's it's very very difficult even to make art you know um basic things you know having your own house food paying the bills all of these things are really important you know and i am not at least i am not the type of person that believes that you need to do everything and anything um for music like you know even selling you know your own stuff just because you want to make music uh, that you have to go live under a bridge no no i personally think that i i deserve the best so i believe i want to have a certain quality of life okay i want to be able to afford the vacation like recently i was able to go to tenerife again why because i've been working so i was able to to pay you know uh for a ticket you know to fly there and i paid for my you know ticket and the hotel and it, it was great you know and all of these things that i deserve and so yeah my recommendation is to really think about all of the things you know that are important in your life not just music or not just your you know passion um yeah because yeah it can affect your mental health um, at least this is my experience and i felt like um it was really draining for me just doing only music and there were times where i wasn't earning money uh, most of the times actually uh, and uh, f- as an independent artist it's very frustrating and draining and sometimes you don't have any motivation you think oh, why would i why should i do this you know if i'm doing this all the time for free for what i mean i could do it for myself in my bedroom but why why would i keep doing something if uh, i'm not getting anything in return it's not fair you know there must be a balance in life so this is you know um something that has changed in my personal life uh, so i have different priorities like i'm prioritizing other things at the moment but this doesn't mean that i'm not doing music actually uh i have just um finished recording a, a great great song and i was the singer so i was the performer 
and uh, I have also uh, written the melody for the vocals and the song is titled Singularity and the composer is Thomas uh, Ria and he's a music producer and composer um, and he lives in Norway and he found me on Soundbetzer which is a website where you can find singers, songwriters, musicians, music composer uh, and where I offer my services as a musician, as a singer, as a songwriter, as a music producer, video producer. So he found me there and he asked me, would you like to sing this song? And I really resonated with the lyrics. It actually, I think it talks about me, that song. So um, he told me that even if the song belongs to him, I can share my own mix of the song which is great. So I will be sharing my mix, my own mix of, of the song on this channel. I still don't know when, but I will. And I really, really uh, want to have your feedback, guys. And yeah, I'm really excited regarding this song. And if you, if you or someone else, you know, if you or you know someone else, um, they want to hire me as a singer, music producer, video producer, you know, all of these services are available on SoundBetsa, where I am offering these services, or on my website, stellawemly.com. Okay, there are these two options, just to let you know. And also, more, more music. Yes, so I've been recording a, a new uh, cover version of a song titled It's Okay, I'm Okay by Tate McRae. So, Tate McRae, probably you don't know her. Uh, it's um, it's a pop uh, it's a pop artist uh, from Canada, and she does really pop music. I think she started in two thousand, maybe late, yeah, two thousand or two thousand. I don't actually know the year, but she's um, one of the basically new pop artists. Okay. And yeah, she has just uh, just released this song. It's okay, I'm okay. It's a very pop song. It sounds like Britney Spears, okay. And I have made uh, another version of the song, my own version. Completely changed the song. It's very dark, very hypnotic, very mysterious. And yeah, I can't wait to share that with you. And I hope that you will like the song. I have produced the song. Uh, compose the synthesizers, so all the synth lines. And today, um, before making this video, before connecting with you, I was recording uh, the last parts of the verses because even though I already had everything recorded with the vocals, I listened to them again and some parts, um, some, some words um, were a bit distorted and sometimes it happens because I have a very loud voice. And so I decided to record everything again. <laughs> well, not everything, everything, but just basically the verses. And actually um, everything sounded even better. So I'm very happy that I pushed myself, you know, and I recorded all, all that verses again. And so, yeah, all the recordings are done. I just have to do the mixing and finish a bit, you know, the arrangement, mastering the song, and then I will be sharing the song on this channel. And also on Bandcamp, I will be releasing the song on Bandcamp. And also it will be available on my website. So my song, uh, It's Okay, I'm Okay, the song, the cover song by Tate McRae, my own version, it will be available on my website, stillawemly.com, probably probably will be for free. I don't think it will be, I don't think I will be able to charge any money because it's, a, it's not my own song. Uh, but anyways, it will be uh, available on my website so you can download it. My website is stillawembly.com or you can listen to the song on Bandcamp or on YouTube, okay? So, and I think that's pretty much it regarding the the music, I think so. And 
PC Music, JH Music and, and Film. I would like to know if this JH Music and Film would like to collaborate or something like that. Because if you do any sort of music or, I don't know, music for movies, we should get in touch. Definitely. Let me know in the comments, okay? Because, yeah, I would like to collaborate. I would like to do more collaboration like this one that I, uh, you know, just done uh, with the Tomas uh, Ria. Um, Terry is a music producer, as I said, uh, from Norway. I would like to do more collaborations for sure. Yeah. And uh, also, there is another important thing that I want you to know. I will be headlining a festival. Yes, I will. I will be headlining a festival. Um, I won't tell you the name of the festival yet. I won't tell you when, because it still has to be confirmed, you know. It's not official yet, but I will be headlining my first festival. So I'm really excited about that. And so yeah, a lot of things going on, new jobs, uh, new careers, new music, new way of living, new me. And that's, yeah, that's pretty much it guys. And I will be doing more live streaming. Probably I will do a live streaming actually every Sunday. And yeah, uh, so try to connect and try to be more interactive in the chat because I would like to know you, okay? I, I really would like to know you more. I appreciate your supporting me on this YouTube channel. There are so many people on this YouTube channel. I think now we have 1,806 subscribers, okay? There are so many people and I really would like to know who you are and where are you watching this video from, okay? I really would like to know you more uh, because you're supporting this channel, you're supporting my music, my vision. And so, yeah, I really want to know you, okay? So next time, uh, let me know, you know, in the comments where, where you're watching this video, where are you from, um, what you're doing, if you have any requests, you know, regarding any videos that you want me to do, any topic that you want me to cover, just let me know, just let me know in the comments, okay? And again, I wish you a happy Halloween. I don't know what you're going to do, but I hope that you will have a lot of fun. And if you, you know, I, you are by yourself and you're not celebrating, it's okay anyways, you know, I hope you are doing well. And yeah, I wish you a great night and I will talk to you again very, very soon. Okay. I love you so much and I will see you next time.